Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel here at Moxie. Today I am talking to you about how to write compelling ad copy. So the first thing to note is that I'm gonna give you a lot of tips and tactics here and you don't need to implement all of these at once. What I want you to have is a resource that you can reference when you feel that your ad copy is getting a stale, when you want to refresh your ad copy, when you want to take it to the next level, when you are afraid that you're missing a piece to your ad copy. Then reference this list. So with that in mind, let's dive into the first one, which is to include keywords in your ad copy. You would include keywords in your ad copy for the same reason that you would include keywords on your web page because it makes it found that much more easily. And as a bonus, if you include the same keywords on your ad copy as you do on your website, then it makes a logical path for someone to follow after they've clicked on your ad. They can see the logical connection there. Maybe you can include a question to help people interact with your ad right away because usually they start answering the question in their mind whether they know it or not. Also, maybe you can include humor in your ad copy. That would be a really good way to connect with the audience as well. Another one would be including a quote or a testimonial showing that your product is loved, has a following, and that people would recommend it for you personally. Another tactic could be including a statistic Depending on your product, maybe letting the science or the numbers speak for themselves would be a way to make your ad that much more compelling. Now let's talk about some ways that you can improve your ad beyond just styles of ad copy. Make sure your ad is free from any and all grammatical or punctuation errors. If you have any kind of grammatical or punctuation error, that's going to decrease your credibility right from the get-go. So make sure you proofread. Another thing to include in your ad copy is a call to action. Be action oriented. Okay, I saw the ad, what should I do next? That's what you want your viewers, your readers to know coming away from your ad. Make sure that your ad copy uses the maximum amount of space that you can. So you don't necessarily need to fulfill the whole character limit, but you do want to make sure it's close to it because if you can get very close to it, then you're maximizing your space and the potential for that ad. Another piece to make your ad the best it can be is to solve a problem. So usually someone's looking for service for your product for a reason. Figure out what that reason is and then answer the problem. Promise that your product can answer the problem right in the ad copy. Also, try uh, checking out your competitors' ads to see what they're doing, what kind of language they're employing. Not to say you're gonna steal the whole thing right from the beginning, but you can use that to help generate more ideas for your next round of ads. Lastly, and most importantly, be clear. I've touched on this a couple times with the previous ones, but just to summarize it all together, if you have clear ad copy, clear directives for what you want them to do after checking out your ad, you're going to have compelling ad. And that's the number one goal. Thanks for joining me here today at Red Moxie. We'll see you next time with another video. Bye.